love you guys and welcome back to all Andy Alfred right here on Clayfan 2 3 I am your host Andrew Alfred welcome you back to another season of all Andy Alfred right here uh, we took a three month hiatus uh, but we are back on the air and we've gotten all of gussied up you can tell you get the Christmas decorations up get the blue jacket stocking over there and a couple other stockings over here and uh, we got the roaring fireplace going over here and then you have the Christmas tree over there and I got some or ornaments and stuff over on the opposite side here at Studio 61 but man it is Christmas out here and it's great to be back on the program here here on clay fan two three um, well let me tell you about what I've done so for the last three months I have uh, worked with the Toledo Repertoire Theater with their production of A Christmas Carol. You can tell over there, the sign over there is all the autographs of the show. Solicitor 1 and 2, Bob Cratchit, Scrooge himself, and the Ghost of Christmas Present and Past. Couldn't get future because it's a whole type of thing. You're listening to the Hallelujah Chorus uh, by Fred Gershwin uh, by Fred Frederick Handel, George Frederick Handel, and uh, it's a great Christmas song. And I was, I did partake in the flash mob at Franklin Park Mall this past weekend. Uh, but let's get into sports. Uh, but we're back, and happy holidays from all Andy Alford right here on Clay Fan Two Three. How about the Lions last night, winning over the Packers seven to three? Drew Stanton. Completed 18 of 22 for 117 yards with one TD. Matt Flynn went 15 for 26 with 177, no touchdowns. And uh, it was a full house at Ford Field, of course, because it was on television. But it is great to see that the Lions get some wins. They're now they're three and ten, going to play Tampa Bay next week. Um, but the Browns. The worst football I have ever seen in my entire life. They had a chance to go in and prove that they can win the game. They can win games, but they didn't. They lost 13 to 6 to the Buffalo Bills. The Buffalo Bills. Fitzpatrick completed 14 of 23 for 142 yards, one TD. Uh, Jake DeLone completed 12 passes of 20 attempts for 86 yards, no touchdowns. Peyton Hillis carried 21 times for a record of 108 yards. Cleveland now plays Cincinnati in Cincinnati next week, and that will be a barn burner because of all the playoff implications for the AFC North. Other scores in the NFL, the Patriots were a winner 36-7 over the, over the Bears. Uh, Miami 10, the Jets 6, Kansas City nothing. Kansas City 0, San Diego 31, Philadelphia 30, Dallas 27, Pittsburgh 23, Cincinnati 7, Houston 30, te the Tennessee Titans 28, that was a Thursday night game, uh, Atlanta 31, Carolina 10, St. Louis 13, New Orleans 31. Now tonight there is two games in the NFL, wait, it's Monday, it's supposed to be only one game, Monday night football, two games going about, what happened in Minnesota? I, you know our friend Nick Devera. He hates everything Minnesota. He was laughing when the Minnesota, when the Mall of America dome fell in with snow. It was just, it was an awesome thing to see. But now they're playing in Detroit. The tickets are sold out, by the way. The tickets that they gave out for free, sold out. So you can't. The only way you can watch it is either on Direct TV or if you live in the Minnesota and New York markets. And that game's at 7:20 on Fox in. Ford Field. Also tonight is Monday Night Football. It will be Baltimore taking on Houston at 8.30. That's on ESPN at 8.30. The Monday Night Countdown starts off at 8. And I love the Monday Night Countdown. I'm starting to, I've been starting to watch that. Um, it is now interesting. I love the come on, man! And they show all the bad plays of the week. It's just awesome. The NHL. Tonight, the Blue Jackets will be in action to take on the Calgary Flames. We'll recap that game for you tomorrow as the as they take on the Flames at 9 o'clock on FSN Ohio. The Blue Jackets are 16-11-1, Calgary 
fifteen and three in the last ten. Columbus is four five and one, and Calgary is four four and two. The versus game tonight is the Detroit Red Wings taking on the L.A. Kings. Seven thirty start on versus. L.A. is sixteen ten and one. Detroit is nineteen six and three. They're the best in the Western Conference. Those jackets are coming up behind. Uh, Chicago is taking on Colorado at nine o'clock. It will be the Colorado. Colorado is fifteen ten and four. Chicago is sixteen twelve and three. Chicago is six three and one in their last ten games. And Colorado is four three and three in the game. Other games in the NHL tonight: Nashville and the Islanders, and Ottawa at Atlanta. This is all Andy Hoff. I hope you have an excellent day. And remember, as always, keep the holiday spirit in you throughout the year. Don't save it all to Christmas Day. And remember, I'm pulling for you. We're all in this together. And especially to the teams behind me and to you, the viewers. Victory is sweetest when you have tasted defeat. Have a nice day, everybody, and I will see you tomorrow for another edition of all Andy Alford.